Whoa, what is that? No. Come on. I'm afraid to even grab it right now. Welcome back. If you didn't see the first episode, take a look at it right now. But guys, unbelievable. So much awesome stuff. Vintage goodness to the max. This unit's loaded with thousands and thousands of dollars. Guy ran a unit for 20 years and collected all kind of stuff. I'm assuming it was his collection. I don't know. I mean, we found everything from Pee Wee Herman to all kind of crazy, crazy toys, vintage video game systems, tons of boxes for video game systems. So hopefully we'll find all the video game systems we found boxes for. And I just saw this box here, so let's take a look. You haven't subscribed? It's free. Don't you guys know it's free? So just subscribe, hit the bell, get all the notifications, see all the shorts, see all the videos, and see all the crazy stuff I buy. Oh, what is this? Hold on a second. What the heck? Look at that, a machine gun tower. I'm not sure what that's for. Base or something, though. <laughs> Whatever it is, it seems to be in here. It says a tracker system, eight microprocessor controlled integrated receiver de scrambler positioner. We know that's why you bought the unit. Yeah. Look at this old. Old school. A little microwave, and then this TV down here is going to be a two man lifting job for sure. It is in there in the plastic. I'm not sure if it's for a satellite or something or radio stuff. So, well, I can't wait. We're going to go back here and start going through some boxes. This one, paperwork. It looks like all paperwork. Oh man, look at that. Cleveland Crunch jersey. Another Crunch jersey. Oh, look at it. Baseball cards of Cleveland. Just shows you the cards. More baseball card. It was this best baseball book ever. Peel stickers. Huh. All the stickers. Look at They peel them. It looks like some vintage clothes in here. Interesting, interesting. Down here, <laughs> we got VHS tapes. We got We Sing Together. And We Sing King's Cole Party. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles over here. Winnie the Pooh. And who knows what else. Oh, I see something good on top. Look at this. It's Christmas lights, but look at what we got. Basketball cards. I'm sure with Killer Instinct cards. Stickers. Basketball. We got a peasant here. This whole thing appears to be all full of cards. And I see cards in plastic down here. You know, it's like a set. So, that's a good sign. Metal puzzles. We got a shoebox in here. Let's see what's in there. Official team book from the Cavs, 97 98. Media guide for the Charlotte Hornets. It's heavy. It's so I mean, I wonder what's in here. It's so heavy. <laughs> Baseball cards. That's why it's so heavy. And this thing is loaded. So that's 91 right here. Don Russ. Who knows what else is in there, but well, I guess that's why you had the price guides and all that stuff. Hocus pocus. 
Wow. Magic trick? Wanna learn some magic chain? The magic show? Look at these metal hangers, wood hangers. These are actually worth money. People love to buy the wood hangers. Very expensive. These metal ones are probably some money. Oh my gosh. This your price, toys. I don't know what that is. I see Red Sox and Seattle Trailblazers and You can tell this guy like put things in bags, everything's organized, everything seems to like be close to complete. There's a little mailbox down there. Again, in a box like this, I might get $30, $40 for it. Who knows? Oh, what the heck? Cas posters. It's the whole stack of Cas posters. 90s. This whole thing looks like it's all Cas stuff in here. There's a bunch of pens right here. There's a Cas tape. Oh, what's this? What is this? It's an autograph chaos ball, but I don't think it's a real autograph, but still, that's pretty cool. If you look in the mirror, you can see it. Tim Murphy. Cavs, all kind of calves pictures, all kind of. So I'm finding tons of calf stuff. All right, this is the one box that we found with all the calves stuff in there. I think the guy actually worked for the calves. But we did find the, the one calves ball in there. Oh, look at that. That's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Donatello staff. Oh, I didn't see these in there. Look at these mini pennants. Boston Celtics. We got a couple Boston Celtics. New Jersey Nets. Portland Blazers. New York Knicks, Miami Heat, Orlando Magic, the Hornets, these are some vintage, these are the vintage mini felt pennants, and we might have the, I don't know if to count them out, where's the Cavs, I know he has the Cavs, I think it works for the Cavs, the Bucks, some cool teams in here, the Bulls, so who knows, but this is the one we had all those little buttons in. So let's, we got the table here. We can actually pour out the buttons and see what we got in here. Huh, look at this. Cavaliers. I've never seen a little brass or a pewter statue like that. That's pretty cool, huh, Mike? Mm hmm Ooh, look at this. League Park. Wow, that's where uh, the Cleveland Indians first played, or the Spiders and all that. I don't know, some kind of little buttons in here. And we have the Cavs. And we have an empty one here. Cavs button, and then look at that. Oh, look at this. Cleveland Cavaliers old school keychain on the flower. Yeah. Flower power from the 70s. And we got a vintage ticket in here. The playoffs, NBA. 850 man here's another one i wonder if this is when the Cavs went to the playoffs miracle of richfield so we'll have to try to look up more of that but very cool oh there's more stuff in here here's vip Cavs. the coliseum cleveland cavaliers versus the boston celtics michael jordan look at these unscratched Michael Jordan WorldCom cards. This is like for calling cards. Remember those? Mm -hmm. You got five minutes each one of these. <laughs> and a picture of Michael Jordan. That's that's priceless. And we have all these calves. Look at this. Upper deck. What is this? NBA drafts. Calves. This is... It has a number in there. There's a bunch of those from Kellogg's. Look at these. Cavs Classic. They're like cards, uncut cards. Holy smoke. There's a whole stack of those.
1978 79 Cavs, 1980 81. Pretty cool team pitchers. Yo, Cleveland Cavaliers! There's a bunch of those. There's more Cavs pitchers in here. So, very cool little box. And then there's all these posters back here. Holy smoke. Classic moments. This whole thing just feels like posters. It might just be all be the same poster. I don't know. Look at that. A bunch of classic moments. The Miracle. 1976. Dutch Boy. Look at these vintage posters. There's a whole stack of them. The seventh game. So these are classic Cavs moment posters. If I could just get five bucks a piece, make some serious cash right there. So, cool little box there. And uh, back to the video. All right, we have the uh, little tight rocking chair. That's kind of cool. Bring that along, you can chill, chill out, Shane. Oh my gosh, this thing's so heavy. Mr. Bishi. Woohoo, what's inside here? More toys. Nike, Levi, Sandy, looks like clothes, NBA Jam, I don't know why it looks like a volleyball though, <laughs> ooh, what's underneath there, actually something looks good, Christmas wrapping? No, I'm just joking. Strax, Off-Road, Baja. Looks like that's what we got right here. Got a Spider-Man mask. Oh, man. Who do you want to be? Captain America or Spider-Man? Huh, Shane? Huh? Huh? Tell us a lot about yourself when you answer that question. Spider-Man. Captain America Shield. There's another. We can both be Captain America. Oh my gosh. Might have to pull this up away. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. There's no need to fear. Captain America and Spider Man are here. Interesting, interesting. Oh, yeah. Power Rangers, more Ghostbuster figures. This guy must have every Ghostbuster figure. This is for Ghostbusters right here. I can't remember this guy's He-Man or something. Ghostbusters. This is Brave Star. Man, there's the mummy. He had them all. Wow, wow, wow. More toys. Nerf. Or nothing. Or nothing. So there's definitely some Nerf things down there. It's like every box is just loaded. Loaded with vintage goodness. Oh, well, I guess we gotta get to that box underneath there. What am I doing? All right, let's see what's inside the old Dell box. What? Skeletor Bank. A bank and that's worth some cash. <laughs> you heard all week, Shane. Uh, we got like, I guess Halloween costumes. We got swords. Lots of armor in here. Oh, we got the Spider-Man. And Captain America. We got the complete outfits, Shane. So that's a cool little box. Halloween stuff always sells. I'm not sure what that is. It's all trapper keepers. 
No rolls. It's probably worth a few bucks. This is all binders. Ooh, what's that? Maggie Johnson. Going around with these little books. Patrick Ewan. Oh, let's see here. Looks like some old. Oh, it's rubber made at those Tupperware. Let's see what year these newspapers are. 2001. Here, some old puzzles. Stratego. Oh, this is like the build play sets. Oh, what's that? What's that? Not this, but that's something. Right here. Oh, right there. Battle for Eternia. The He-Man game. These are all little kids' toys. <laughs> all the boxes go. That's a good sign, huh? We found them all, so now we just gotta match them all in the boxes. At least you have something new this week, Shane. Since you're always bored. What the heck? Uh, let's go up here first. That's a weird pail. Bug. Holy Frisbees. Gonna be down, Spurs. You know, cool. Next year, toys. More toys. Putt putt. Little cheer. Shot. More Bria stuff. Uh oh, what's down here? What's down here? More toys, vehicles. Oh, this is like double dragon. Oh, got a bag. So we got some Marvel, more mass stuff in there. And so, this guy's got toys everywhere. Everywhere. You see some toys here? He's got toys on his toys. Oh man! Looks like original pound puppy. I don't know if it is or not though. <laughs> Stuffed animals. <laughs> Who is it? God, I know it too. Come on! I even give you if you say both their names. Bert and Ernie. All right. That's Ernie. Come on, Bert. CD right? Da -na 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 -na. Batman. So I'm not sure if this is a... This looks like maybe Star Wars Play-Doh set or something. Who knows? Vintage Play-Doh. This box right here. Oh. What the heck is this? Oh, it's a smash castle. Holy oh, cobra vehicle. This used to have something up here that broke off. I just love it when he got his bags. That's for he's all bagged up. Oh, these are Britons. That's some good money. West Geauga Baseball. More Knights helmets. Oh, oh. Is it Mario? How much did Mario have? 1989 applause. Fantasia. Memory card for PlayStation. Oh, it's the hand puppet. Now you can play at home. She just keeps surprising me, surprising me. And then I just see this thing right here. 
It's all full of vintage Cavs hats. And I mean, look at this. 1975-76 American Basketball Association. That's the ABA. Yearbook and media guy for the Cavaliers, 77-78. I mean, this is some vintage stuff in here. And I saw a paperwork earlier, and I'm thinking the guy might have actually worked for the Cavs. Golden State Warriors, 75-76. Isn't that Jerry West? Mm -hmm. Wow, this whole thing is just, I mean, there's Cavs pennants in here. I mean, that's just a vintage, vintage Cavs box. Look at these vintage Cavs hats. What do you think, Mike? Nice. You want one? Was that corduroy? Yeah, corduroy. That's how you know it's vintage. And then in here, you get all kind of old. Look at this. Media guides. The official 7576 America Basketball Association, the ABA. This is before NBA. Look at that old Cavs media guide. Hmm. There's 97, 98. This whole thing was all these old media guides. Got all different years. Got a whole collection. Ooh, what's this? A new era, Cavaliers 2. Huh. Okay, so I know all these old media guys are definitely going to be worth some cash. There's a bunch of books in here. And like I said, I think the guy worked for the Cavs because I found some paperwork. He might have been a lawyer for the Cavs. 81 Cavs calendar. That's pretty cool. These are the little things you guys I don't get to show you always because we have to go through the stuff in the unit. We can only show you so much. Oh, look at this. 1978 Cavaliers NBA Playoffs Coliseum. Unused tickets? Whole stack of them. Huh. Floor tickets. That's gotta be worth a few bucks. Got a Christmas card in here. Can we get lucky and get some money? Look at the new era Cavaliers. So this is inviting them opening nights, 1979 against the Boston Celtics at the Coliseum at Richfield. So this is whole thing is just a Cavaliers packet. Oh my gosh! Look at this. Cavaliers NBA playoffs home game. Time and date to be announced. Probably didn't make it that far. But look at this. Whole thing. Unused tickets, Mike. Nice. Holiday greetings from your Cavaliers organization. So that's some stuff you just don't see all the time. They must have been like early season ticket holders. And this whole thing is just full. Cavs courtside corner. So maybe they're season ticket holders, maybe it works for the Cavs, all kind of stuff. But vintage goodness for sure. So just want to show you a little bit more of stuff that we found, but unused tickets, all these yearbooks, and awesome hats. But back to the video. More toys. Fisher Price. Oh. Oh. Laser beam. Oh, we got more hangers. Oh, whoa, what is that? No. Come on. I'm afraid to even grab it right now. All right, let me. We'll go to this box real quick. This box has a bunch of wires in here. Phones, old controls, game tips, Sega Genesis, Nintendo Secrets. These are all worth money. What do you see what I see right behind this box? Oh, look at this. Oh my gosh. That is all in the town. Oh. These boxes are crispy. I don't feel the games in there though. But look at how nice these are, Jim. Double dribble, double dragon too. Mega Man 2. 
Oh. Zelda and Link. I mean, these... Mega Man 3. These are all money boxes. Hopefully we find the games that go in the boxes. Wow, wow. I mean, you guys don't realize how much some of these boxes are $50 a box. Oh my gosh, look at this. Ghostbusters. I was looking down and there was a Ghostbuster sticker in there. These are basketball collector cups. Oh my gosh. This is a cup dispenser for Super Mario Brothers. Oh, that's hilarious. We got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Bowls. Almo Cup. I mean, if you haven't seen a Vintage Goodness locker yet, this is one of them. Oh, snake oil. Oh. We got magazines. And I just seen right here fall out. Cards. This looks like all soccer trophies. Medals and medals. This person was good. They were good, Shane. Oh man, look at the binders right here. Kevin McHale. James Worthy. AC Green. Akeem Elijah one. Looking for some Jordans. Where's some Jordans at? We know we gotta have some Jordans in here. Oh my gosh. That's how old it's been sitting in here guys so long. Look at all these cards. James Worthy, John Stockton, Clyde Drexler, all sorts of teams. So we'll have to go through those, but man, if you have one card in here, prepare for the unit. What the heck? That's crystal, it's a ship. More vintage toys. Schwarzenegger. That's a uh, thing from Street Fighter. So, man, this guy just has so much vintage goodness. Paperwork. Trophies. We'll move a few more things, see what else we can find. Ooh, I see something back there. All right, this unit just keeps giving and giving. And, you know, this unit's so awesome, I want a trophy. So I just want to thank the Academy. I want to thank Shane. I want to thank my parents. I want to thank my wife and my kids. And, oh, sorry. Anyways, so let's see. I don't know. There's stuff all around me. There's another brew box. Viewmaster. Oh. Little people. And this thing is just filled with toys, toys, and woo! Cookie Monster. He wants some cookies. Oh. More of those train tracks. Ooh, this box of toys. Oh my gosh. I know how the toys are. I see Superman down there. And... These guys are from like Mortal Kombat. It's crazy. It's I didn't really get a chance to look through here. So I saw there was a Superman in there and a couple. Guys, look like Mortal Kombat. Oh, wow. We got two of these guys in Mortal Kombat. A bunch of more. Oh, look at this. What's that guy? Robocop. Man. Why can't you live the sheltered life? Mm -hmm. Look at this. Storm. You know who this is? Silver Surfer. All right. This guy's from Mortal Kombat. How about this guy? Flash. Look at He wind him up and his arms move. <laughs> <laughs> he run real fast. 
I don't know. It looks like Schwarzenegger almost. Mm -hmm. Oh, this dude. Uh, chop your head off. Oh, oh, oh. Well, careful where the axe is landing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Punisher. Is that the Punisher? Wolverine. Here's your arm, Wolverine. Here's the Incredible Hawk. We got your arm right here, buddy. Get it back in there. So I think this guy, these guys here, this I believe is G.I. Joe. This guy's probably another Mortal Kombat or Dr. Doom. The top. Avengers! I don't know. Superman. Oh, here's Silver Surfer Board. Take a look at that, Mike. Let's go this way. Pretty tough. So, you just never know what you're going to find, what you're going to see. And that's why we love buying storage units, especially for vintage goodness. Extension cord. We got some clothes right there, but man, these toys. Look at this vintage Browns gear. More vintage Browns gear. And more vintage Browns gear. Notre Dame, Montessori. I guess we gotta go to the top. Uh, Direct TV. And close. Oh, this one's heavy. Oh, come on. Please, please, come on. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, that feels like it's in there. A Turbo Graphic 16 in the box. Oh, that feels like it's in there. A Turbo Stick in the box. Oh, my gosh. Guys, 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 Turbo Booster Plus, Turbo Graphics, Turbo Graphics, a blue turtle, no copyright infringement, you know what I'm saying? There's so much more to go through, man, we'll show you guys some more, appreciate you guys watching, once again, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, hit the bell, give us a thumbs up, you never know what you're going to see, you never know what we're going to find, and man, this unit has been the jackpot.